The views and comments expressed on the following radio program by its hosts and their guests do not necessarily reflect the views of rmconair.com or its affiliates. Listener discretion is advised. You are now tuning in to the Ron Pierce's Hip Hop Show. Roscoe's Media Center presents the Hip Hop Show, hosted by LaRon Pierce, the JJE in the building. Yeah. I hear y'all talking. I ain't listening. Fuck that. This shit is real. Y'all a bunch of bullshit. You wanna question my shit? Listen up, motherfuckers. I've been real since day one. They say I can't flow, I be knowing my fight I was born in the evening, but it wasn't last night This is real, baby, y'all are feeling my heart I knew my place in the game and I ain't fearing my part From the start, I was climbing uphill Instead of writing my verse, I should be writing a will I ain't deaf, I know what the industry say Is Cena gonna make it on the mic? No way He's a gimmick, just a flash in the pan Fuck that, I keep spitting till I'm crashing your plan And I thank a higher power for my passionate fans And I'm taking this flight I made this record with no dealer advance That's me giving back to the movement that gave me my chance You wanna question it from here when I drop? Cut me open, motherfuckers, I be bleeding hip-hop Beats, rhymes, and life, a pat in the pen You about to realize I'm a man among men You having trouble trying to figure it out? Listen up, you'll understand what I'm talking about Beats, rhymes, and life, a pat in the pen You about to realize I'm a man among men You having trouble trying to figure it out? Listen up, you'll understand what I'm talking about. Yeah, I see through the game and picture your names. I'm keeping y'all at arm's length. All you cats are the same. Faded pictures in a broken frame. On the strength, man, the burden I claim. Deferred fame, but I never change. I memorize my stride. Separated all my ego from pride. Been the mission of mine. Been the steadiest climb. All odds to find. Man, I lost my mind. Man, as hard as I tried. I couldn't find a minute's peace. It was simply denied. Pressure applied. A stepping inside. A world of negative vibes. Daily grind. Black and white, not a craze to find What I could find, I write rhymes Through divine intervention at times My philosophical view is in conflict with you Cause everything you live in for Is negative too, that's my new interpretation Of you Beats, rhymes, and life, a pat in the pen You about to realize I'm a man among men You have trouble Try to figure it out Listen up, you'll understand what I'm talking about Alright, 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 alright This is LP, the Rob Pierce, the JJ in the building You're tuning in to the Hip Hop show and I am your host Listen, Ron Pierce you know what I'm saying so I'm gonna so go ahead and go, and go into a break go please, we got two Johnson, special guests in it tonight with cheese, and I'm gonna introduce them after this after around. this break all right keep my watch a little fast I'm ahead of my time let's go ahead and go into the break real quick Listen, yeah. the showstopper, Nate Palm Bomb Dropper. Competition get going like hot fuck. Like Listen up, ride started the four fifth of stop ya. Might not see slim, but I still got a partner. Blacking out like the California doctor. Pigs in the ER asking who shot ya. Rest in peace, big pun, big pop. But the game need a new big man. I gotcha. Chasing rock like them thugs on the block when I chop. Bag and traffic, hip hop from hot coast to coast. Cross the water through international borders for the slaughter. Step up, place your order, then deserve. Bring the rock like Sean Pease, so beat my words Chemically imbalanced, mentally disturbed Nasty with the verbs, syllabically absurd right. Tidy bold rappers get their blue water spit on They're funky, looking like something that I shit on A bishop is my father, and a Christian is my mother With a pack of rubbers, I'll be sinning like a motherfucker I keep it 100, never tell a bitch I love her Just find her, forget her, in between I fuck her The circle line, about to set sail Cross the Pacific, but she know excel What time is it? It's time to zone out It's time that the bullshit garbage get thrown out it's time for class now, our gunners get shown now. East, west, north, the south, I'm in the zone. What time is it? It's time to zone now. It's time that the bullshit garbage get thrown now. It's time for class now, our gunners get shown now. East, west, north, the south, I'm Level in the zone. Level stand up. Watch me tear through heaven and let hell settle. Fuck transformers, I am really made of metal. Yeah. Insane benevolent, never changing, I'm arrogant. To rappers, my ratings considered the Jesus equivalent. Remaining adamant, direct like James Cameron with a camera. Stabbing you quicker than any aperture can capture. Half human, half God to clash in a titan. Flashing like a hydrant, laughing when I stick my knife in. Dismiss 
Listen and pissing on the type of women you wifing. Lyricist hyphen, actor stronger than a bison. Riding on Rebel Army, I'm not advising. Like Tim Dog walking through Compton, hoping nobody recognizes him. Crazy. The animal wild and his big Gino causing problems. Sick in the mind and spazzing in violent volumes. I'm permanently tarnished. Your vermin deserve this facial scar. And Jimi Hendrix have you drowning in your own vomit. Oh. The decorated vet tear like perforated edge. Killing your family, you can even get your sister sledge. <laughs> Living violently is only way of describing me. Human skulls in my backyard like I study anthropology. Yeah. Be brave, but you will not live another day. Read your horoscope for tomorrow, I guarantee it's blank. My rank's perfected in a game that is so infected. You niggas all sound alike like Lil John records. What's time okay. to sit? It's time to zone out. It's time that the bullshit garbage get thrown out. It's time for class now, while dumbest get shown now. East, west, north, the south, I'm in the zone. What time is it? It's time to zone out. It's time that the bullshit garbage get thrown out. Word. It's time for class now, while dumbest get shown now. Yo. East, west, north, the south, I'm in the zone. Yo, lyrical lasers launch from the lyrics that shine brighter than suns and smarter than parents. Uh -huh. My metaphorical peaks is really audible like high pitches to male pitches showing no fortitude. Forking over dudes, bullied by the balls, while his bank account keeps seeing those like Rick Ross, which bitch can get tossed like a top player car. I'm at the goal line, these niggas won't make a yard. A real spinner, take two or three niggas to deal with him. You take criticism, I take critics and deal with him. Fast murder tracks, it's only right I kill with him. Told Chino he's a beast, I had to keep it real with him. Too much skill, rebel arms with sick writers. A fucking blowtorch, you niggas be big lighters. Bling like King Midas and bomb like John Unitas. I strive and catch a body, y'all niggas catch off writers. I'm body body, 2 OG with no limits. My gimmick is spit flow with no gimmick. Give it those midgets, make roll show with no digits. A baller knows he can't take shots with no pivot. I flow wicked like gold swimmers in Olympics. Let the show shift it, looks I rip it. Prolific, let a law misfit, MC bless the law gifted. The calm lifted, my words switch the palm scripted. What time is it? It's time to zone out. It's time that the bullshit garbage get thrown out. It's time for class now, while dumbest get shown out. East, west, north, the south, I'm in the zone. What time is it? It's time to zone out. It's time that the bullshit garbage get thrown out. It's I was there at the moment she died. Eyes wide open, fixated on what waited on the other side. Taurus Luke left at 945, just the way she would have wanted on the wings of the sunrise. She kept the world down to the day that she passed away. Made a promise she would end the hospital stay to watch the All-Star game in a couple of days. Me and Dro wound up giving her the play-by-play. -play. Hell and I was a favorite. Even rocked his jersey during games and raised it on whenever he made it. Every call by the refs got thoroughly debated. Reminiscing got me missing all the time that I wasted. I wasn't always so patient We argued like most families do And she knew just how to say shit Screaming at the dealers on some government name shit Like David, don't sell that mess in front of my pavement Always checked out for holidays, no doubt Enough Christmas lights to land a plane in front of her house She defined ghetto fabulous Planted silk flowers in the garden And grilled the best government cheese sandwiches Shit, I thought I could handle it Sip on some yak, keep a candle lit And just reach on But now it's just me and my mom's And she keep wanting to speak on What I'ma do when she gone Not a day goes by, I ain't Playing a song, year later waiting on that call all day long. First born day without hearing a voice on the horn. Had me finally realizing my grandmother was gone. Just go and ask anyone on Kenwood Ave about Miss Luke, they probably crack a smile and laugh. And tell a story just like this one about a giant that stood around for 11 and a half. My grandmother. To love you is a privilege, the grand and grandmama, I'ma to lose the sight for you and I both an obstacle. In through tubes, couldn't bear to see you in the hospital. Bedridden, my feelings kept hidden. Resort to all this hiding while trying to keep from crying. So daily I'm denying how and what I feel inside and you the glue to this family and but lost without your guidance. From you learn self-reliance, how to turn little into a lot and well the proof was in the pot when fresh from out your kitchen, the center collards and chicken, itching to take a peek in. I ain't wanna beaten. What's good and when you put your foot in bread pudding Can surely testify ain't nothing like home cooking At home you made it Though I was frustrated Now elated you ascended So it's time I celebrate it And tell my little cousins And even until my nieces That you love everybody And you're gliding around with Jesus I know you're looking proudly And if there's ever doubt The easy breeze from my kitchen Tells me that you all about me So no catching falling stars A spirit you calling cards Near or far I know exactly where you are And I love you ma But you be told An angel must spread its wings So fly you are not mine to hold Mine alone Oh. <laughs>
All right, all right, all right. I am here and back in the building, all right? I am your host, LaRon Pierce. I am the host of the Hip Hop Show. And we got a special guest in the building, not just one. We got two. You know what I'm saying? First, we got um, the original guest we have is Arjizzle West Bread in the building. Yes, 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 yes. What's the deal, everybody? Arjizzle West Bread in the building. And then we got the the king who just did the, his show. He say, she say show just an hour ago. You know, King Gerald Jones in the building. You know what I'm saying? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening. All right. So, uh, man, what is going on with these? Pick it, Mike. Is, is it that? that? I think it's that mic. Yeah, I think it's this mic too. <laughs> mic but, um, check one two. You probably gotta yeah, hold yeah, yeah. it. I, I'm actually gonna hold mic it. Check, mic check. So yeah, what's going on, everybody? How's y'all evening? Man, thank you for having me. I appreciate you having man, me. Man, it was a pleasure for doing your show, man. After yeah. this, you know. What thanks, I mean? thanks for having me as well, man. Man, that's a, that's an awesome, man. It's, it's an honor. You know, I, what I'm I get, I get the. Un- I was listening to the music you was playing, and I get the underground feel right now. It's not mainstream, but underground. So I'm feeling that right now. Yeah, man. I don't really. I don't come in with the nonsense music. You know what I'm saying? I yeah. came in with the real music. Yeah. Or just no. He knows yeah, I yeah. play real music. Real, and I, yep, this right on a hip hop show. You know what I mean? If you're trying to come, listen to some real music. Tune in every Tuesday at nine thirty because the hip hop show got it all. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. So um, I am a little late on the news. So let me go ahead and interview you. Interview interview you guys individually. Okay. So um, starting with King Gerald since um he's here right here right next to me. So. So Gerald, so what we um so how how's everything your day? How's the what do you think about the show that oh, everything is good. I, I love doing the show. Uh shout out he say she say, uh shameless plug. But um you know, I love doing the show and I appreciate your engineering. As far as man, my day is good. Pleasure, man. It's good. I, I really want to talk about hip hop. That's why like I said, I get the underground feel when I come here. So I wanna exactly. talk about hip hop. Like even oh it's funny, I was just talking about this today with I'm older. I know how are you how old are you? I'm uh I'm actually 14. See, see, he, he's I'm, the I'm younger. I'm a uh, freshman in high school. See, he's the younger generation. I kind of, you know, and I, hopefully he has uh, a lot to offer. Do you rap? What do you do? What do you do? No, well, I'm an all-around entertainer, man. I'm a, uh, I can dance. Oh, okay. I can act. I'm a rapper. You know, I do it all. Oh, okay, that's I cool. I do it all, man. See, that's good. Well, like, for me, I'm gravitate towards the underground because the mainstream, to me, I just feel that yeah. the young, the youth, don't have too much to offer right now yeah. but that's why i'm looking towards the underground to see what they could provide and you know it's a better listen not yeah. to cut you off jerry we have yeah. mama we have mama west bread in the building <laughs> <laughs> go on to the camera where are that where are that i see where i'm, I'm coming to one of these two hey but I didn't come to be on. I'm just listening, right? I'm you can actually be on because right? this is my show, you know. Right. I'm just, I'm just you know, going to listen. <laughs> listen. Yeah. And we, uh, if you notice, we have a, a song of the day that we play during He Say, She Say. So, yeah. So, you know, it's good. I love music. I love I love real music. So the underground feel and the music that you play, and I, I really gravitate towards that. Yeah, man. I've been doing a lot of music um, also, so that's why I always, like, inspire just to do a lot of music and everything. So then back to our Jizzle West Bread. So yep. how are you doing, man? So what you got plans for the for the week and so? Um, this week, well, I'm really just chilling. You know, I ain't really went. I didn't got invited to a few places, but I ain't went really because, you know, because it's going to be Christmas. So I'm just really chilling with the fam, you know what I mean? Everybody just been chilling with the fam. Yeah. And, you know, just chilling. Now, what he was saying about the underground music. Underground music, I like underground music. But mainstream is where it's at. I mean, if you're an artist trying to become big, right, you'd right. want to go mainstream right, right. nine times out of ten. You're right. Underground is cool, but you'd always want to go mainstream because that's where the money is. That's where you're known at. You can You can become... A superstar. Right, you're right. You're absolutely right. Yeah. Uh, underground, think, underground. I, you're known, but you're not known as much as you, if you were mainstream. I think the and you're absolutely right. You absolutely, of course. Ultimately, you want to get the money. That's what we in it for. I think more so. I was trying to like describe paying your dues. I think okay. you should have to go through the underground stages of building your brand, building your listeners, building everything. Because I don't know. Um, it seems like they're just throwing kids or young, youngsters out to the piranhas now, and they're not cultivating their craft and they're not cultivating their you know 
what they're trying to do. So yeah. I, you're right. Ultimately, and I hope anybody that's getting into it is ultimately trying to be mainstream and make the money to support yourself. Agree. Yeah. Yeah. I just feel like underground, pay your dues, pay your dues, pay your dues. Right. Okay. All right. So um, we're going to go ahead to a hip hop news. Yes. All right. So we're going to have uh see what we got today for the news. Uh, let's go ahead and do... Mm. What you got? What you got, LP? Let's what you do got? RZA what you discusses got? current state of the Wu Tang Clan. Oh, okay, Wu Tang, Wu Tang forever. Wu Tang forever, baby. Wu Tang forever. <laughs> what is he saying? What is he saying? Is a uh... um. I'm going to read the. Okay. Go ahead and read the article they wrote on HipHopDX.com. Okay, so so the story is following the release of Wu Tang Clan's A Better Tomorrow album this month. Frontman RZA spoke with NME to discuss the much, much publicized opposition he faced with the ver- various from various Wu members d- during the making of the project. I'll level with you. The chemist, the chemist, the chemistry is not all that good right now. RZA says, "We've all done this long enough to know this process isn't just like you make an album and that's that." It's like a presidential campaign. You don't just make the policies, then sit back. You create your platform. Then you got to take it out to the people. It's like an energy. It's like an energy in the group that stops people enjoying their own success. They got to sabotage it. Later in the conversation, RZA likened the album to a child that, that's born with an arm, saying, you got to love that child. Make the best of, the, of that situation and help it have the best life it can. RZA also spoke on a purpose on the newly, newly released album. The goal is, was always to change hearts and touch souls, man, or, or RZA says. It's like from, that, from the minute you get it in your hands from the cover, that's an imagined city where everyone's culture is respected. We got the Eiffel Tower. The Hollywood, the Hollywood Hills. We got you guys' wheel, and it hit me that I thought the world had got better, but it really he got it got just better for me, not for others. But um, I just now realized that speaking of RZA, I, I just now realized that he was on the Bishop Don Juan show last week. Oh, was he? Yeah, he was. Uh, he was actually on the guest, and I'm like, when I was watching and when I was working uploading shows and all that. He was on there, and I'm just like, "What, RZA, the legendary RZA?" Yeah. <laughs> in in the Bishop Don Juan show, that to have Bishop do like to bring in RZA, that was just a great, you know. Yeah. So it's crazy. So, so what you guys think about that story about the album that that was just released? Well, well, me personally, I me personally, I wasn't born. In the Wu Tang era, so I can't really say too much about it. You know, I know about Wu Tang, about RZA, stuff like yeah. that. So I can't really get too much in detail because you know that's not in my era. Right. I understand. So basically, I see where he's coming from. You know, with the albums and stuff. But I mean, I don't know. I don't know, man. What do, What do you got to say? Um, as far as the Wu Tang, I think he was basically trying to identify that it's going to be problems working with so many artists, especially artists that have had some level of success. So, I could anybody could have told you that. Like, if you're working with guys who've been doing it for years, it's going to it, like even scheduling is going to be difficult. Just like how yeah. we do scheduling with the shows. Yeah, like, that's always going gonna to come the, that's at a different time. Be the case. So I think he's going to it's going to weigh heavy because also the passion might not be there as like it was in the beginning when Wu Tang was you know first putting things out. Because when you're broke, you're more hungrier. Yes. And, and the yeah, passion that's is always there. Happens. So once you feel you had a level of success or you've been there, done that, it's not going to be as uh, the thirst not going to be as real as it was back then or whatever so i think that's what he was just trying to identify that getting these people together getting this group together is not going to be the same okay yeah so i totally agree but um yeah the wu-tang clan is a legendary hip-hop group right that's never going to change about the fact that like they need to stop making songs because it's because they're getting old and pretty much they got to pass the torch to other hip-hop artists you know especially drake who um Rele- um, two years ago, he released a song called Wu Tang Forever. I thought it was a disrespectful song for like, 
Yeah, I thought. Well, oh, oh, on his uh, on his um. Nothing was the same album. Nothing was the same album. No, I didn't think so. It's a dope. It's a dope song, to be honest. Right, right. It's I, a dope. I, I, I thought it was cool. I, I didn't it cool. think it was disrespectful uh, in any type of way. It was a good song. His album sold, even though it got leaked. Some people downloaded the leaked version. Some actually yeah. supported it and bought it. It was a good album to right. me. I can't really say nothing bad. It was a great album. Right, I agree. I totally agree with that. But then I um see about. Read the information about Wu Tang Clan, and they said they want to collaborate and do Wu Tang Forever remix. Then I'm just like, okay, well, if Wu Tang respect it, then yeah, you I, gotta respect it. I ain't got nothing to say about that, you know. Yeah. But I mean, it's all about respect for the hip hop, you know what I mean? And um, let's go into another news. So we got Master P says. He can help save the L.A. Lakers season. Oh, <laughs> I heard about that one. I didn't I hear that one. That's, what, that's news to me. <laughs> really? <laughs> How old is Master P, man? He's like, <laughs> talking about he's he like don't go near 40s, like 49 oh, or something like that. I don't gonna know. going to be 50. I, why, don't quote me. Don't quote me. <laughs> I don't know how old the dude is. I just know he's been. I know out for his a son is like right. twenty four, twenty five right now. Right. You, you what he's, is he actually talking about participating and playing in the actual NBA game to help him, or is he talking about coaching wise or whatever? Well, let's go check it out and see what's going on. Okay, so here it goes. He never played in a regular season in NBA game, of course, because he was never part of the NBA. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, the Los Angeles Lakers have one of the worst records in the NBA this season. They posted an 8-19 record thus far, and they're on the three-game losing streak. Um, of course, because Kobe always ball hog and never passes. No, no, it. okay, okay. See, now I got a button on this one. See, LP, you took it too far, LP. I'm just saying, I'm just saying all the games. You, let you know me tell you I mean? something, LP. Kobe can be a ball hog. Let me tell you, let me tell you why. If he sees that his teammates are not putting up the points they're supposed somebody to, has to put up somebody points. has to put up the points. Kobe's putting up 29, 30 points in a game. Twenty Between 25 and 30 points each game, Kobe is putting up. Right. I mean, he can, he gives other people chances. But once, he sees, yeah. once he sees that they're not performing to to their requirements, right. he right. starts ball hogging because somebody has to make the points. Right. Come You're on absolutely now. Right. I, I totally agree with that. Yes. I totally agree with that. Well, sometimes you gotta pass the ball all the time. I mean, sometimes. I mean, I mean, look, I mean? he he passes the ball, but once he sees every time he passes the ball, they don't make the shot. He doesn't pass anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Why keep passing that, if you that, see that thing? That, that's like, like that's like giving a robber gun. If he keeps shooting the person, you ain't. Fin- <laughs> if he keeps shooting the uh, the hostages, you ain't finna give him the gun right, back. Right, <laughs> right, right, right. All right, let me go ahead and finish this story. One rapper believes that he can change this during a spot interview with TMZ. TMZ. Masterpiece spoke on the Lakers' recent regular season woes. They need me to come back, he says as he exits in the airport. Kobe needs somebody to put him in his put him in place. Whoa, see, okay. Okay, hold on. Let me read the rest. <laughs> Let me read the rest. Peace short thing in the league involved tryouts with the Dallas Mavericks and the Charlotte Hornets, plus preseason game time with the Toronto Raptors. He never played in the regular season in the NBA game. I played against Kobe. He know what's up. Oh, Pete Jones. oh whoa. <laughs> is that what he said? That, that, that's, no, what he, so that's what he, he said. said. But let me read the rest. He he just needs someone real out there with him. Earlier this month, Kobe verbally abused his teammates in a right. heated five-on-five five scrimmage that went viral. The 19-year veteran called his peers soft. Right. And attempted to make the workout uncomfortable for them. Yeah, uh, Kobe Bryant was very disrespectful when he said that to him. I because mean, he got because he if got elbow. You, if you see, soft, you soft. Come on, man. Come I on. I understand that, but he he should have never said that. Like after the game, and he was like sitting there with um with the homies, with his um players and all that. He was talking he was talking smack about Dwight Howard. He was a soft soft a n word and stuff like that. I was like, really? Mm. Well, let me, let me say this, man. Let me say this. I believe, cause you got to be politically correct. Right, right. Now, now this 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 is what I believe, man. Him calling Dwight, so I mean, he didn't have to put it that way. You know what I mean? He could have kept what he felt to himself. Right. But at the same time, basically, he wasn't gonna tell Dwight he's good and he's not good right. to pump him up. I th- I but th- I think if he felt that he was soft, he could have said it in a you know in a not a nicer way, but. Like a more professional way, and that and that brings me to say it's not really 
what you say, how you say it. Exactly. He could have told him the same thing, but like you said, in a more professional way or whatever. But call him so. I mean, I don't know. I don't know the level of their relationship or their situation, but no one wants to be talked to crazy. Nah. Nobody wants to be talked. And it's Never not going to make you perform better. Some people, it's not going to make them perform better. So like you said, uh, piggybacking on what you said, yeah. it's basically not what you say, but how you say it. Yeah. You can convey the same thing, the same information, but just do it. Because I know for me, if I was on the team and he was getting at me like that we would have been fighting so yeah. I'm pretty sure Kobe don't want to fight me so just, just respect me and, and tell me if, where I'm messing up at or if you feel I'm soft you could tell me you're not being aggressive enough yeah oh see he, exactly and, and, and again he didn't have not, to ins- he could have said it but he could have said it without insulting right me. right 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 okay so I got another story to bring can I bring up a story on your show LP um it's about hip hop man okay okay <laughs> So basically, we talked about this on my show before. Oh, basically, yeah. Lil Wayne is trying to get away from cash money. Wow, Correct. Okay. Man. So he was tweeting. I read his exact tweets. Don't quote me, but he was saying he feels like his work is being imprisoned and stuff like that. So, ba- so basically, he's trying to get away from cash money because right. you know, right. Young Money is under cash money. Right. right he's right. trying to get away from that. He feels like he's a prisoner. His work is being kept you know Birdman won't let him release the album he's telling his fans like if they're fed up with him for waiting for this album they have every right to be stuff like that how do you feel about the whole situation him wanting to get away uh Birdman not letting him release his album how do you feel about that because to be realistic he already recorded the album correct but he can't release it so if he wanted to release it independently on his own he'd have to re-record the whole thing because that's Cash money, young money material. You're right. You're so how, right. how do you how do you feel about you know, that? And it must be something serious because you know they was go- they've been uh, friends, whatever you want to call it, business partners, friends. For he's even referred to him as like his father figure. So it has to first of all, it has to be serious. Yeah, it has to be serious for them to be at odds on Twitter and fate or whatever over this situation. And I think it's you know. At some point, you know, I'm sure he wants to have some kind of creative control. He's already put out his, you know, classics. He's yeah. already put out his hits. And I think it's more so he's trying to be more creative and Birdman not just with it. He wants to hear the classic way, but exactly. you, you kind of got to let that bird fly. And with that being said, if you're not willing to let him do it, then you got to release him. Yeah. Release him from the contract. If, you know what I mean? I don't know the money situation. I don't know how many con- how many albums he's under or whatever exactly. the case may be. Right. But I don't know. It must be serious for them to be at odds and they've been friends. Because even if you remember, a lot of other uh, rappers left Cash Money a long time ago saying yeah. that Birdman was foul or in no sense. But so for Wayne to finally catch it up after these years and say now he's foul, you know, yeah. it's kind of crazy. Yeah, but. Basically, and it's like the same thing for Tiger. Tiger's trying to, uh, right, right. yeah, you know, Tiger's trying. He's dropping stuff independent now. Like even on the interview, Tiger said like him going independent is gonna cost him even more money. He's gonna have to pay for his own videos. Like right. he just dropped a video uh, a few weeks ago. It's called I forgot the name of it exactly. But when you look under the title on YouTube, uh-huh. instead of it saying uh, Young Money Cash Money, it says Last Kings. Last Kings is his uh, independent oh, little. Okay. Uh, label he okay, has okay. so y- if you notice he's starting to drop more stuff under himself independently right, right, instead of with them right right right. so it's like you know he he has more of a chance of getting out his contract than Lil Wayne though why, Lil, why Lil, do you say that because Lil Wayne is more embedded into yeah, it yeah. he's more embedded right. Tyga Tyga is signed Sign straight to it, right. straight to Young Money he, like he's not really signed to Cash Money he's signed to Young Money gotcha, gotcha. but Young Money's under Cash Money but I feel like Tyga has more of a chance of getting out than Wayne right I, I agree I agree especially they didn't give him the, the check that he worked for for his album that's kind of that's kind of who shady. oh I didn't but, hear about who yeah I don't know what, what, but this was like to me. this <laughs> was like a couple of years ago this was like a couple of years ago and he was supposed to get his check from promoting the album and releasing it and everything but cash money and young money didn't really give him any cash for he had to work on his way up to like get royalties that's from terrible him. that's yeah it's it's horrible speaking of Birdman, did y'all hear about the spider-man the amazing spider-man cover what happened wait what happened i'm gonna let y'all show i'm gonna let y'all see this okay wait let me let me turn the screen so i can see lp let me let me check that out Wow. You got to be kidding me, right? Wow. Did, did you see that? Uh, oh, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to wow. be kidding me, right? Stan Lee, 
No disrespect. I mean, but, just... but, but is it okay? So that that looks like it's the cover of a comic, correct? Yeah. yeah. So, so you know, some people make their. So is that something off the internet or is that official? Because like you know, some people. I can heard make it's their, official. And it's it's a it's custom edition. It's I've never heard running, of it. it's run by lugs, but Stanley, if this is true, you should kill yourself. I'm sorry, because <laughs> that's very disrespectful to have like a, a comic show and then have Birdman in it. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. That, that, that's, <laughs> well, to me, that's is, very is he playing the villain? Is he playing the villain in this situation? I have no idea. This Cause just cause came cause up. To be honest with you, I'm gonna say this first of all. If this is true. <laughs> Birdman get his money. That's the first thing. Second true. of all, I mean, if he's playing a villain, I could kind of see that and understand that. I, yeah, that's I would, true. I would hope and guess that Spider-Man is trying to bring his uh, brand up to speed. Now, this is what's relevant right now. We can't keep making the uh, amazing Spider-Mans about the uh, people back in the day. He yeah. need new villains. and So if Birdman, what, he's going to be the music villain? <laughs> <laughs> the record exec villain? <laughs> That's also true, but yeah. All right, so uh, we're going to go into a break. Um, all right, Jizzle? Yeah, you want me to take what? What? <laughs> I'm going to let you introduce the song, but it's the second track. I want you to introduce it because it's going to be part of the break. Uh, okay, well, I'll introduce the track. You know, we're going to go into this break real quick. This is a hot banger right here. Let's go into it. Y'all going to be vibing to it. It's turned up. You feel me? We'll be back. We'll be back. You are now rocking with the best. Are you ready? West Coast, Los Angeles. Wait, wait, so what you West, West, Los Angeles. Wait, so what you want to West Coast, Los Angeles. Wait, so what you want to West, West, Los Angeles. Wait, so what you want to do? I soft on signs. I'm trying to fully equip to make it through all time. Forget that. Music real. 
real music. Th- this is the remix. Music real music. Th- this is the remix. Music real music. Th- this is the remix. Beat, 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 make the glass break. I don't need no window. Screw you about the game. Take notes, get a pencil. We make it so difficult. I make it so simple. 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 Time to like the dogs in the kennel. Music real loud, blow your eardrums out. Homie, what you mad about? Cause I style out. If you need me, girl, call. All you do is dial loud. She be mad if I don't pick up these girls while I'm out. Play, I look brand new from my head to my shoes. I know I took your girl, wasn't trying to be rude. But prepare for destruction, prepare for the worst. You know I'm killing this, be prepared to get it hurt. Look, it's time to go to work like I'm on a job. Look, it's time to get Get turned like a door knock. Fresh like here, look at this way fly in the D6. Fresh like my feet. Beat knocking, beat 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 knocking. This is the remix. You know we had to do the remix. Beat knocking, beat 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 knocking. This is the remix. You know we had to do the remix. This is the remix. I don't need no window. This is the remix. You know we had to do the remix. I don't need no window. I I don't need no window. This is the remix. I don't need no window. Okay, so we turned up, we turned up on the hip hop show. What's up, everybody? What's up, man? What's up, what's up, LP? Not much. I'm chilling, man. Uh, we just listened to uh, our Jizzle West Brass um, off the mixtape called, what is it called again? It's called The Prince of L.A. The Prince of L.A., oh, man. The mixtape. That's, that's the reason why he made the show. And nobody noticed that I'm the engineer of the show. So. Yes. <laughs> yes, he's the engineer of my show, The Prince of and L.A. And also, if y'all didn't know this man that who just got on the show an hour ago, no, two hours ago, because it's 10.07 right now. Um, he says, she says, the host, the main host is King Gerald Jones, and I also engineered that show. To be honest, that show is, that show is one of my favorites, other than um, Prince of L.A. and Generation U and Bishop Don Juan show. You know, that's one of my main shows, you know, my favorite shows to work with, and Prince of L.A. and Generation U. And now we're in my show. The hip hop yeah, show. The hip hop show. I just mocked Scotty Trippin'. Y'all didn't know that, huh? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, um, I just was so um What's up? Oh wait. Hold on. What? What? Let's go ahead and do these four unsight ra- unsigned rappers, you know what I'm saying? As I um go ahead and um do these things. Or just go ahead and talk to the fans and um shout out your just just talk to them. Just talk to them. Well, everybody. Um, if y'all don't know already, I'm Arjizzle Westbread, a.k.a. The Prince of L.A. That's my stamp, The Prince of L.A., you feel me? Follow me on Instagram at Arjizzle Westbread underscore, and bread is B-R-E-D. So, yes, that's me. Um, you know I have a, a mixtape out called The Prince of L.A., the mixtape. You know you can go down that. And also that, talk about your tip. show, too. About my what? Also talk about your show, too. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, my show. The Prince of L.A. show. See, that's just the stamp, the Prince of L.A., you know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> but uh, the Prince of L.A. show comes on Thursdays, guys. From 7 p.m. to 8 p.m., we have different people. We've had Hit J3, AVLMKR. Uh, we've had, you know, um, DJ Bugsy has, has DJed on there. A lot of other DJs have, de- have DJed. I've DJed on there myself. Um, it <laughs> airs Thursday, like I said, and I do it with my co-host, A-Game. She's not here tonight, but she will be here Thursday. Well, not this Thursday. because We're trying Christmas. to get her in before the end of the show. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> we, we'll try to get her in here. But, yeah, man, that's basically that's basically me. That's my show. You know, I'm a fun kid. I'm in high school. So, you know, I'm in high school just living still. Yeah, yeah, that's a great show. You should tune in at all times. Yeah, but I don't think this Thursday they're gonna be on there. Oh no, but, it's, it's, Christmas. it's Christmas. So, so you want to spend time with your family? Yeah, go to your grandma's house, see what she got for you. <laughs> Speaking <laughs> of my grandma, she just texted me just now, but I'm gonna answer the text later. <laughs> so, we got one of the favorite songs that I've that I chosen. Um, this is um. Even though it's hip hop, but this is a Christian song. It's a um, hip hop song. It's been out. I don't know if that's a Christian song, but it's a hip hop song by my former te- my former middle school teacher. His name is Dova Pacino. Dova Pacino, and he goes by actually everybody should know him by Mr. Leak, but his stage name is Dova Pacino. Don't ask me where he got that name from because he'll tell you when he gets in the, when he gets during the show. Damn this mic. So um. As they said, ladies and gentlemen, I'm announced this. Dolo Pacino. Mr. His song, Link. <laughs> Drop Bombs. You're now tuned. Dolo Pacino. Uh, let the prophecy be fulfilled. Check it. Come on. I'm Drop Bomb. Number one in the hot list. Bringing Bill Ball Platinum hits. Say I'm on my life. I'm kiss. So platinum. Not that they call me Sir Platinum. This is a kid. Imagine coming on. Complex as such. With no guidance when I look up. Like twisted, word up. My life's a constant battle every single day that I got. 
trying to wake up. Same poverty, pop storm, mom struggling. If I didn't have a wisdom, then I would have nothing. Maybe I'm brash, but my thoughts reoccur. Why do we fight? Why is my child of the world? I want to give thanksgiving so that everyone needs. I am desired to see my races up in unity. Can you truly see the vision thoroughly? In my mind, in my be I'ma touch my reality. I walk and notice the proceeding to my destiny. I want to see my life flourish till eternity. My world is nothing like this. It's just the opposite. So much. Smashing up on the side of the park like Barry Barnes made so positive it's how I live. Never negative, I'm America's most wanted undiscovered kid. I see another artist for in the world there. I'm attacking all enemies, there's no fear here. I've been through the fire, been tried and tested to reach the bit of me. I'm a father's invested, my style is volatile. They try to arrest it, you can't hold a brother back, no need to test it. I'm broken the power so sick, it's like a tin child. I'm bone crusher up in this. I'm going in the spirit, I'm a Jedi Knight with the power to move mountains every day, every night. Say what I have to say in my rap tonight And I'm drop bomb Number one the highest Bringing me up on platinum mix Tell them I'm a light on kiss So platinum not if they call me Sir platinum mix I say I'm drop bomb Number one the highest Bringing me up on platinum mix Tell them I'm a light on kiss So platinum not if they call me Sir platinum mix I watch Kelly slide lost Whether good or bad Who's a real story Tell her whether happy or sad Overdosing drugs Dealing gang banging in hat Many bodies at the felon Guys zipped in the bag to all my thugs in the game, bangers, put the heat down. Respect to who respect this hood and get involved in the child's life. And watch his spirit evolve, it just feels right. From one man to another, my brother from another mother. We all the struggle, but we still all puzzling in this maze. We all be involved with rap stars with bling and fancy cars. I got to have my fathers were done, they had the bling. Then lose my life from my soul, they had this rap thing. Can you feel all the pain? Cause I'm trying to stay sane. Praying every single day, just trying to maintain. I'm drop off, number one in the highest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys are tuned in to the hip hop show. Show, show. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now he just killed it. Now just playing. The no, hip hop yeah, show. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> so um, we back in the hip hop show. Um, Dola Pacino. Man, you need to hit me up, man. I know you're trying to come in the studio with me just so I can be, so you can be my guest on my show. Man, call in, man. Three two three nine six five. 1600 now for the second song probably need to pick up the mic lp so yeah <laughs> as i always pick up the mic so um our jizzle go yep. ahead talk to the fans real quick as i do another song well i already told y'all about my show you can follow me on instagram like i said at our jizzle west red um i've been doing a lot of stuff man i've been going on auditions I've been, I actually booked a non-smoking commercial. I'm the main kid in the commercials, basically pictures of everybody else flashing as I talk about everything. So I'm the main kid that will air in March 2015, March 2015, all over TV. So Wait know, a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Did you say, did you say a non-smoking show? A non-smoking commercial. Oh, commercial. Yes, it's a, it's a commercial. Um, I'm in it as well as my three brothers. No, my two brothers. I have three brothers, but only two is in there. The other one was too young. Oh, yeah. So, uh, basically, I'm the main kid in the show. It's ba they got pictures of my brothers, pictures of all the, a few, just a few other people as well. So, basically, I'm the main kid. I'll be talking throughout the commercial as the pictures are flashing. Right, right. The commercial right, right. airs in March 2015. Y'all make sure y'all check on that on TVs. Yep. It's, he's it's on it. He's on it heavy, man. Especially as, uh, talk about, um, before, we, before we introduce another song, just to talk about your uh, your um, was it a show or a movie that you're working on? Was it there? Oh well, I been on set, you know, just helping out. There's a new show coming out. I'm not in, I'm not on the show yet, 
YT yet. Just stay tuned, fans. But I've been on set with Zendaya and many other great actors, man. They're all great actors, you know. Um, it's a new show coming coming out. It's uh, Casey called Casey Undercover, and it's basically about a family of spies. She's basically the main character. Cause wow. It's, it's Casey Undercover, and her character is KC, so... You know what I mean? It's it's a it's a cool show. It's basically about a family of spies. Um, just watch, man. It airs in January 2015, so just look nice. out for that. It's it's a really good show. I mean, man. yeah, thanks, man. I was uh I was on set, and they make all the actors do a run through and see how many people laugh. So if it's not funny enough, they edit, go back upstairs and edit the script and do it again. Mm. That show is gonna have you cracking up, man. <laughs> I'm right. telling you, it's it's a really good show. Everybody, you need to tune in. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely get a cable just to watch this show. Oh yeah, no. Nah, Cause that. I don't really watch TV like that. I only no. the internet's the new TV. Oh my gosh. So man, <laughs> you ain't never lie. Like my cousin the other day, he was asking me, "Have you seen this movie? Have you seen the preview for this movie when it's coming nah. out?" Like I don't see no previews because I don't uh, even watch TV no more. If you look at me, the it's the internet is the new TV, people. Like Sorry. I'm telling you, like I don't watch. Like I might go into the room. I might go to my grandma's room when I'm at her house or. I'm, or even when I'm at home, I go to my mom's room or something, and sometimes she'll be watching TV. My mom and dad barely even watch TV, so right. that's how you know the internet is where everything is at. I mean, people, if you think about it, people are watching Netflix. That's over the internet. People Hulu, are, people, um, Hulu everything. Amazon, Insta Video. I, I, I got mean, all those three, but. Everything. It, people are downloading movies from the internet. I mean, come on. You go yeah. to theaters and I just downloaded, um. Passage of 57 and um, Batman Returns and yeah. you know, Batman Forever and Batman and Robin. So yeah. those are one of my favorite um, movies that I picked, yeah. you know. But, but I got more movies to download. Yeah. So. But everybody, we don't want to hold you up too long. We're going to go into this banger real quick, this song. Yeah, and, and, um, not, and not too long ago, GX and Kevin McLaren, a.k.a. K-Boy, was in the Prince of L.A. show was a guest in the Prince of L.A. show. So I'm actually going to have to play one of their songs. It's called If Your Girl Only Knew. It's a sample. Well, it's actually a dedication to Aaliyah album thanks to the wackiest, pathetic Aaliyah movie that we all just see. I didn't see the movie. I just saw the pictures, how people look. And Jizzle can tell you a little bit about it after this. If your girl only knew that you was trying to get with me, what would she do? If your girl only knew that you was dissing her to talk to me.
what you're saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's the deal, everybody? Welcome to the Prince of L.A. show. We turned up. Yeah, it's me and my co-host, A-Game, on the Prince of L.A. show. Uh, you already know we taking over. This is our show, Wait. the Prince of L.A. show. Make sure y'all tune. What? 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 Wait. What? What's today? Yeah. Today is Thursday. It's our show. <laughs> it's, it's not Thursday. It's Tuesday. <laughs> But it's still our show. It's, a, whoa, whoa, it's the whoa, Prince whoa, of whoa, L.A. show. Whoa, 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 whoa. Tuesday, Thursday, Tuesday. Hey, Thursday. Wait a minute. Hold up. <laughs> Prince of L.A.? No, no. This is a hip-hop show. They they lying to y'all. This is a hip-hop <laughs> show today. This is Tuesday, man. Oh, my but yeah, well, we do got the guests of the Prince of L.A. show. And uh, why is Siri talking while I'm talking? I was just Hold up. I'm going to have it, or just a rest brand and, um, to talk real quick before I um have to sit and talk to Siri real quick. So... All right, Jizzle, take it away. Well, everybody, y'all thought this was Prince of the L.A. show, but it's not. It's, it's not. It's really the A-game show. Yes, it's really the A-game show. <laughs> oh, no, no. Ah, see? <laughs> see, it's ain't nobody not. doing that. No, 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 no. But for real, though, we are here today, tonight, tonight. For my good. Showing some love to L. Peasy. LP, you know, he engineers my show, and he does a good job. You know, sometimes, He's you know, usually job. about some engineers, you just have to say, like, no, you're moving too slow. You do this no, guy right not. here. He be on point, y'all. Like, <laughs> like he's a good, like, yeah. If you book him, book him. If you have Look a radio that. show, he'll come straight to your studio and do his thing with the keys and a bam, 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 and the knobs. And, <laughs> yep. If you got something to say about the Prince of L.A., then you got to deal with me because the because the song will sell you that's a problem. You know what I'm saying? Problem. Uh, 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 if your bitch ain't acting right, then that's a problem. If your money ain't right, that's a problem. That's a problem, nigga. That's a problem. 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 If your bitch ain't acting right, if your money ain't right, ain't right. Ain't right. Ain't right. Murder was the case, that bitch just killed your body. You claiming that you pivot, you the fucking lie. You can't deny the fact, and from what I'm saying, that's, that's a problem. See, really is belief. Haters talking pride, if they don't want no issues. Want no issues. Cause if there's really problems, then my heart's an igloo. These niggas fake as fuck, hearts is made of plastic. I see it good like HD, and they don't want no static. No if you ain't about this life, no problem. If your bitch ain't nothing right, then that's a problem. If your money ain't right, that's a problem. That's a problem, nigga, that's a problem. On the road to this bitch, hey, nigga, know your road, stay in your lane. I ain't with the game, don't fuck with lanes. I'm getting dollars, stacking up my chains. Money over bitches ain't shit changed. Throw the stove on it, that long range. I'ma hit a nigga with that long range. I get it popping like the gun range. I'm a super Kelly Jamie nigga. nigga. On the hustle, get any figures. Mind on my money, money on my mind. Gotta go make it. Tell them niggas I ain't kidding. I swear these niggas act like bitches. Talk loud, I don't listen. What they talk about, they don't live it. Fake niggas make me live it. If you ain't about this life, no problem. If your bitch ain't acting right, then that's a problem. If your money ain't right, that's a problem. That's a problem, nigga. That's a problem. 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 If your bitch ain't acting right, if your money ain't right, my nigga Micah told me we don't grind, we don't shine. We don't hustle, we don't eat, and that's the bottom line. Young entrepreneur trying to grease my palm. Billionaire visionary trying to beat these out. Young black from LA, they said I'd be gone. Still here, cause I'm supposed to be on. It's some guys' plan, so I'm leaving everything in guys' hands. Super Kelly time, check the clock, nigga. Matter of fact, fuck the clock, just watch, nigga. From the belly to the alley to the blocks, nigga. In the city, getting busy at the end. On the city, Terry Owens, Russell Simmons, I'm perfected engineering. We hot, we hot, nigga. I walk in with my problem solver. Six shots, chrome revolver. Got 99 problems and no a bitch ain't one. You hate on the next man about this bread, gon' get you some. Hold up, little swole up. Nigga mad cause he can't get his dough up. Your bitch shoes every time a nigga roll up. Fuck you and a bitch nigga no cuts. Ayy, if I ever go broke, I'm a problem. Lord, please forgive me, that's my problem. That's a 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 problem. If your bitch ain't acting right, if your money ain't right, ain't right. That's a problem. 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 That's a
Yep, yep. The Prince of LA show on the hip hop show. That's a problem. That's a problem. That's a problem. <laughs> Our jizzle all around. That's a problem. Wow. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and I am the host of the hip hop show, LaRon Pierce, the yeah, JJ yeah. in the building. Um, shout out to Super Cali Everything. That they were dope. on they were actually on um on He Say She Say show oh, okay. and King Gerald Jones was just in the building and he just did his show two hours ago. So yep. okay. after that, so yep, yep. I got a yep. special announcement. Speaking of Super Cali Everything. We're gonna have Super Cali everything being here in the in the studio in January 27th. Oh, that's cool, man! It's great since they all <laughs> knew me since I engineered he say she say show. Mm -hmm. They're gonna come in my show and they're gonna promote all their stuff, even the songs, okay. all the other stuff that's in cool. my show. That's what's up. I like that song too. That was cool. Yeah, it was dope. Yeah, but that was sped up, guys. It's sped up. I'm like. It's yeah. a club banging while you like you dancing and all that, but you know. Mm, 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 mm. It was like but, a yeah. machine gun Kelly type. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some walker flocker. Cool Make you wanna just shake a shake a dread. Yeah. Dreads? Okay. Yeah, but that was dope. That was cool. Yep. Though. Yep. I like that. All right, so we still got the guest, the Prince of LA show. We got a game. In the building. And then we have our Jizzle Brist Brand. It's the, the Prince. Host. It's the Prince, of course. <laughs> so, um, what you guys think about the show so far? Well, man, this is the second show, I believe, correct? Mm, I heard it, but it was the first one with, um... What was the... Uh, no, 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 no. No, I'm saying, this is the first... Yours. This, this is, is I mean, this is the second show for the hip-hop show, correct? I... Yes, yes, yes. okay. I like it. I watched the first show, and man... You you did a good debut, man. I, I really wa I watched it on YouTube actually. I didn't get to tune in live, but when I watched it, it was good. I nice, salute man. I, I really salute you to that. And thank you yeah, for having me on. Shout out to Alric, yeah. who was the guest on my show and who also was a guest on Generation U Radio show on Friday night six o'clock. Shout out to Scotty Trippin. He's the host of that show. We got the co-host, all the women and all that. So <laughs> that's my homie. But yeah, shout out to him and um. Uh, and they died. They're actually in um, Arizona right now. They're having their business out there during the Christmas time, you know. Okay. Shout out to them. I hope they can make back safely, you know. That's what's up. Yes, always safe, right? Yeah. That's what's up. Sure. Yeah, so, uh, Jizzle. Mm hmm. I got a question <laughs> for you. What, what, what is that question? Have you heard of the rap? Speaking of, that's a problem. Arr. Would you mind introduce the song that you wanted to play? Yeah, man. This is my hot single right here. Straight off the Prince of L.A. Make say go download that on Dat Piff. Dat Piff. This is my single right here with Problem. Mm -hmm. G Kid. G -Kid. It's a reggae banger, a reggae slash hip hop banger. So we finna play that for y'all right now. Let's go. Music is my life. <laughs> well, don't let A-game sing it for you. That's but I hater. Mean, that's no. hater. That's all right, though. Because, see, I know I don't know how to sing. And I don't, I don't hide it. But I feel it in my heart. No, See, uh-uh. That's all bad. Miss <laughs> okay, well, right anyway, guys, up. this is Music Is My Life. We're going to go into it. Uh, A-game ain't on the life. song. It's just me, Problem, I and G-Kid. I should have been on the song. I'm still looking at baby. Oh, rap your old rap. Really? Yeah. You really going to do that? In a skirt. I ain't got no, I, ooh, I ain't got no old rap. <laughs> rap. Hey guys, well if you don't know A Game, a -game. we did a rap um no, no she didn't in her younger days. No, she did Hey yo, she, what? In her younger days. Oh, no. you better freestyle in my show. Uh -uh, no. Oh, are y'all <laughs> She did a rap. Anything no. goes. Anything no. goes. Look. This okay. is my look, show. Look, okay, now I gotta t now I gotta tell it. See, you get a minority <laughs> kid. That's why I see. See, when you do stuff and your kids and your nest coming back, it's biting me. It's biting right. me. Yeah, she had right. a rap. Okay, no. His dad, right? His dad. Entertainment, he did his thing. He he asked me to do it. I was just being a team player, so I did it. But I can't, you know, I'm rap not, it for us I'm live not, on the hip hop show. Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I am not. Anything goes, the that artist. game. 
Cause I'm not the artist though, and I can't I can't even rap on here what I said because I got I can't do it. Gotta Those are her thuggy Jizzle. days. Thuggy. No, it's like. Jizzle. What's up, LeBron? See, I, we, pa- we passed Cover it over. Your, we passed it over because I want to hear this. No, Le- I'm just gonna slide it to you. You know, I'm gonna email it to you or something. You know, so you can hear it yourself. I'm not finna sit up here and embarrass myself. <laughs> Remember, this is my show. Anything goes. But Le- <laughs> but Le- no, look, that's the evil life. She don't need to freestyle no more. LeBron is up to something right, right. sneaky. He's nah, up to something. Nah, nothing. Something. Uh-uh. <laughs> they lying to you. Okay, no, for real though, no, nah, it it ain't nothing, y'all. I'm not I'm not the rapper. I was just being a team player, and they needed a voice. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even write it. Whoa. I'm, I no, because it well, wasn't for me. You know what I'm saying? I was just being a voice, like that's, I said. Like if we're not gonna have it on the show, I'm still gonna hear it. So you gonna hear if y'all it? Y'all not gonna hear it then? You gonna hear it? Oh yeah, so. he gonna hear y'all. But it was it was so. it was for a mixtape. It was off that for a gorilla. mixtape. It, it was off that gor- it was off that. Gorilla Zo, what was the uh, Gorilla, gorilla Zo? Remember the beat? Remember Gorilla Zo came out? I can't do it. I can't Ooh, do it. it. <laughs> was it a hood, hood brother or something like that? I yes, forgot. yes, uh, yes. The beat I is love banging. That beat. Yeah, yeah I love the that beat. beat. Oh, it, but I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm sorry. Y'all. Come on, hey, who who got? I it? actually did a Back. I did a freestyle when I was like Do 14 it. years old of out that beat, and really? I dis I dis Gorilla Zone off really? his own beat. <laughs> well, it be like that. That sometimes. was funny, but yeah, it was it just a like joke, man. Shout do, out to Gorilla Zone. I don't Shout know out. if he's doing any music or anything. Right, so. you know what I'm saying? You had it. I ain't no diss, man. You I had it. Man. Do Do we have an instrumental? No, I'm just playing. You know what? <laughs> I'm just messing. I'm just messing. I'm just messing. LP, can you freestyle for us on your show? Freestyle. Yeah. Come you on, asking though. the wrong person to freestyle. <laughs> not See, true. that's, a, that's how A game feels. <laughs> right. See, you do this. I don't. I, I, I'm. I'm on the other side of the table. Y'all hearing this, right? Right. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm a. So, like she said that. All right. So, since so she said that, so I'm gonna do this after this song. So, Jizzle. Introduce your song real quick. <laughs> he not going for it, everybody. He's not going for We're it. We're going to bring that in. Music. Okay, so anyway, that. like I was saying before. I can do that, though. See, A-game. A-game. No, what? I'm just playing. I'm what just playing. Now? See, he always trying to bless me Well, out, guys, though. this is. Music is my music, life. Music is my life. Um, It's me, Problem, and G-Get. It's a reggae slash hip-hop banger. It's turn up air. It's a fusion, data. y'all. It's a fusion. Yep, yep. We mix it all together anyway, everybody. Come on, it's, this is the single right here. Music is my life, featuring Problem and G Kid. My song. Let's go. My Stay song. tuned. His song. Music is my life. Turn up a day though. Turn up a day though. Turn up. Music is my life. 24/7. Turn up a day though. Turn up. Music is my life. Turn up a day though. Turn up a day though. Turn up. My life. Seven. Five, I know it's even sleep by night. Turn up a day Get that every day though. That no play but your play though. Stack like ego, A OK though. Why? Real d- on my payroll. So hardly ever be nervous. Nah. I'm buying out the boy. Your girl took more shots than Curtis. Bah. She took more shots than Kobe. Kobe. A100 don't know me. Your money talk me so phony. Shining like this gold is all on me. Whoa, look at that. Whip black as a brickly cap. Big body, you can cook in that. Gave yeah, you love, but I took it back. Took it back. Wow. Yeah. Say they trying to get that green, so I told them go. go. Said I should throw them something. Shit, I told them no. Get mad, be a body. Get your thug on. Yeah. No handouts here, I keep gloves on. Oh, I'm off my phone. Oh, oh, oh. High. So high, if I fall, I'ma freaking die. I'm so freaking fly. fly. Check the fizzle. Check the fizzle. L gang, pretty poppy in our jizzle. Turn up. Turn up a day though. Turn up a day though. Turn up. Music is my life. 24-7. Turn up a day though. Turn up. Music is my life. Turn up a day though. Turn up a day though. Turn up. My life. Ain't sweating that, I'm sweating it out, keep sweating it. They in and out, stuff on that flow. I'm all about like Russian metal, you run down. Just up, everybody an artist now, but the real ones gon' hold it now. I'm trying to switch it up like right now. And you know I'm killing everything that's in my way. Music is my life, all night, all day. See my juice, bro. If you didn't know, get with the model, watch somebody ask John Doe. Ha. At the tip of top, I can't stop. Got the trap steam, not finna hop. It's ringing like a doorbell. Echoing like a cell. Well, I'm a firecracker. I get some coffee. You straight group, just came hopping. With a winning team, spot out me and see. It's no one to compete with thee. It's no one to compete with thee. It's the friend. It's no one to compete with thee. 
Turn up a day though. Turn up a day though. Turn up. Music is my life. 24-7. Turn up a day though. Turn up. Music is my life. Turn up a day though. Turn up a day though. Turn up. My life. We don't get to sleep at night. There's no one to compete with thee. Yeah. There's no one to... I like... I I don't know why that stood out tonight. Yeah. There's no one to compete with thee. That was like... That was the the prince. (laughs) There's no one to compete with thee. And we are back in the hip-hop show, so <laughs> got the Prince of L.A. show in the building, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's a cross-brand boy. show, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so then yeah. A-Game, I don't know if what? you guys heard about this, um, A-Game was asking me to freestyle, so... Yes, uh, yes, I we, was. I was asking, Jizzle. we were both asking. We well, want to hear Jizzle it. Well, asked as well, so... I can do it, but I don't know do, how Do I'm you want me to beatbox, or are you going to play a beat? I'm going to do this acapella. Oh, I, can pa- you I know you everybody want- heard this heard this many and many a times, but I'm gonna do it then. Okay. Right, Let's see what you're spinning. <sighs> Bro. My ultimate experience is support real hip hop when it's about politics, not shooting people with a Glock, the story of revolution, making the point of solution about how the end wars in the constitution Woo! and all the government schemes and fix the pollution. And we need the females to end prostitution, hey. make a difference for America, and we need freedom. Before the government started an acts of treason, they use Obama as a scapegoat to tell more lies and everything right. that they said, but they don't realize that we are revolutionaries ahead. They're not just to spit lyrical things to make a freestyle challenge. My boys a point. All your brothers do is smoke a joint, talk about women, causing the money, so what's the point to this rap game? Which is kill when no one can judge about my lyrical skill. Uh, see, that was a political, a political rap, okay? He talks about, about everything. That's, That's LP. Right. Slap it up for him. All right, all right, all right. Slap it up for him. Slap it up for him. That's LP right there. There we go. I like that. Check out his SoundCloud. Yeah, I what? got a lot of songs on there. Um, you can just Google me, Let The Raw Pierce. I got Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, SoundCloud, Bandcamp. All the app, socials. Hot, all that, so. Yeah, see. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Get your knowledge up. Man, Mess you with know. this boy. Man. Sorry. And actually, that first verse was <laughs> off that song called Ultimate Experience. There's two versions. There's one off my EP called the Ultimate Experience EP. I released it on October 20, 25th or 26th, mm-hmm. 2010. And last year, I released a remix with a third verse. Okay. Well, it's not a remix, but it was just a... You revamped it. Revamped. Yeah, okay. I forgot. It's a reprised version of the song, but just add a third verse. Add a third verse. An extension. It's, verse, it's, so. it's an extended, extended version. version. Extended there version. There you go. All but right, you're right. on your toes. But see, my debut album, Judge, Jury, Executioner, Execution. that's going to be on the track, Ultimate Experience Remix. 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 Yes. So, um, okay. all right, y'all check your boy out. He got Period. some hot stuff. He let you us he let us listen to some stuff in the listen car. Listen to the boy words. Yeah. Saw from the but brain. see, I've been listening. I've been having them listen to unreleased music that was not even expected to be released. But that some of the songs will be released in 2016. But 2015, mm-hmm. yeah, it's I'm done. gonna be yeah. Bring it. Don't even trip. I mean, yeah. Don't even trip because we're gonna bring you on our show to premiere. You know what I'm saying? Drop it. And we're going we gonna to do it big, right? Do it big. Of course. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, you show us love. We show you love all the time. Uh-huh. Hey, I appreciate the love. <laughs> we're at peace. And I always, <laughs> always show love to the Prince of L.A. So I always go and yes. chime in to yes, like talk about some topics on, um, you know, on Jizzle West Bread. Keep that ball Prince of L.A. So, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I see this show is going somewhere. Oh, yeah. We're this gonna show is really things. going somewhere. That's why I have them on, as a guest on the show because... They're like the first main special guests because we because they work for RMC and they work for it's Roscoe's family. Media Center, you know. Mm-hmm. And they work for Johnny Morris, who's my boss. Um, so so yeah. yeah, we all in the same gang. Okay, yep. should, we always. You know the song. Just how, just how. <laughs> Lil Wayne, Nicki, and all them is from Young Money, Cash Money. We from RMC. So y'all see what I hit with, and you saw what he would hit with, and it was the same thing. But I think we just showed our ages. <laughs> See, RMC is family. We yes. open arms. You know what yes. I'm saying? We oh, yeah, open yeah. arms to the family. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? True, true. So let's go ahead and do our shout outs. It's the last segment of the show. Yes. Well, I want to. Well, let, you, no, let, 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 no, you're the host. Actually, you're the you're the host. Yeah. You're the I host. know I'm the host of the show, but I will let the guests go first. We be getting carried away. 
Thank you. Thank you. I'm not trying to pull a uh, DJ move. So, Jizzle. But. <laughs> go ahead, take it away, brother. Well, I just want to give a shout out to all my supporters out there. Oh. I want to give a shout out to my whole Slowly. team, the whole RMC family. I want to shout out myself. My st- what? Oh yes, my no, I'm just playing. But for real, my supporters, my uh, my family, supporters. my team, the whole team. RMC family, RMC family. Um, hey, ladies, the Roscoe's family. He's good looking too. You better holler at him. Hold up. No, I'm taking. I'm, ta- I'm actually interested in this other girl right now. So nobody. I'm sorry to let you know on the show, mom. But uh, right, this yeah. is new. Oh what? Oh, Hold this up. is the hip hop show exclusive. Oh, exclusive. Mama finding out about somebody. What? Hold up. Who she be? Hold up. You gonna bring out? I'm, a, I'm, I'm not gonna like, say her name on the show, guys. Gonna She's gonna be part okay. of. Oh, hey, oh, I'm gonna, gonna bring the. Out? I'm gonna bring the Prince of LA show, and he's gonna bring his Excuse chick me, right in this show. This is the. <laughs> I have a public service announcement. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> you may like. You may look. <laughs> oh no, 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 no! But no. this is nothing. He's focused. You stay focused, and then we all come together later when you're no, over twenty one. Just because, <laughs> just because we focused, don't mean like I shouldn't like stay have a girl focused. or like nobody. But I'm saying, no. Everybody but anyway, I want to give a shout out to oh, everybody. That's gonna be on our show. That's gonna be something very good to talk about. <laughs> I want to oh, give a shout yeah, out to my family, uh-huh. RMC family, my supporters, my supporters, whole team, everybody. RMC. Everybody, I want to give a shout out to everybody who supports me and behind me. Yeah, Go ahead, again. Yeah. Well, um, I'm not available, guys. I'm interested in somebody right now. Go ahead, again. He's not available even with her. <laughs> anyway, so <laughs> we gonna turn this back over. Thank you, Laron, for having us on your show. We've had I, I, I wasn't on here that long though. Jizzle came yes, in. Yes, I know you've been doing so. He's been, he's been telling me what you've been doing. So I mean, uh, I was yeah. checking out the facility. Mm. So. <laughs> <laughs> I smell higher. No, I'm, just I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's all good though, y'all. No, but for real. Thanks for everything. Thanks for having Son. You know what I'm saying? Thanks for doing what you do on our show. Um, it was a pleasure. This follower stuff that Instagram, just just hit your girl up. A Y underscore game on Instagram. Drop me something. I don't know. Hit us up. You never know. I might have you sitting next to us on our show. I don't know, but but you know, thanks, Roscoe's. Pitbull, Jizzle, even though he always trying to throw me under the bus. It's okay. <laughs> Laron, of Never. course. And then you know Wait what I'm saying? Wait a minute. Why me? No, 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 no. That's the thanks part, not the under the bus part. Oh. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you missed well, that I part. I said I, I was back on the thanks part. Oh, oh. So, um, but yeah, so yeah. And everybody involved and everybody that support and watch, you know what I'm saying? And keep it going. And we got good things coming for the new year. Boom, boom, boom. Right? Yeah, yep. yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, last but not least, the host. L P C Exactly. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the show. It's been a while. Well, we like fourteen minutes an <laughs> hour and fourteen minutes <laughs> into the show, so um I suppose it being over, but I just wanna get in. We ain't got no callers today, but it's cool. I got the Prince of LA show behind me, so I ain't tripping. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanna shout out to uh Johnny Morris, my boss, who gave me the privilege to do the show, you know. And my uncle trying to shut me down because it's a hip hop show, but I'm like, uh, it ain't the type of hip hop show that you're gonna listen to. Ain't right. no shoot 'em up bang bang type of thing. This is a real hip hop stuff ain't no that chitty, chitty, bang bang. Nah. <laughs> Super Cali, everything can tell you that's a problem, if it is, so I just want to shout out to him for um, for um, getting the Roscoe's chicken and waffles. You know what I mean? He's the owner, you know. And at the same time, shout out to my dad, and shout out to my mom. Um, she was in the hospital a couple of week, couple of days ago. She's feeling better. Oh, Praise that's good. Mom. Praise the mom. Yeah. Fam, we got y'all. Just praying, for, just praying for recovery. No worries. She's we been doing that. a lot for everybody, including myself, my sister, family members, and all of that. She just needs mom. If you listen to this, he needs to rest. <laughs> listen to dad for once. Rest. <laughs> you know rest we hold in bed. Down. But yes, mom, get some rest. No Bartimaeus, no going to work, no helping all people. Rest in bed. <laughs> R.I.B. Rest in bed. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. And I also want to shout out to Prince of L.A. show for allowing me to engineer their show on Thursday nights, even though they're not going to be on the Thursday show, ter- no, Thursday this week, which is, up, which is upsetting, but... You know, we'll be back fresh. They'll the be year. back next year, next year, and they will be back on the first show. Well, maybe 
on the first show. And then I'm going to actually have a guest coming in on January 6th, which will be the first show of the week of the week of 2015. Man. We have Vader V Lane coming in. Mr. AAA, I'm calling you out. Shout out to him, man. He confirmed they wanted to be on the show. Shout out to Super Cali, everything they wanted to be on the show. And they're going to be on the show on January 27th, you know. Kudos to them. Thank you for letting me play in that song. That song is dope. Once, once Super Cali, everything is in the, is in the show, oh, man, it's all going to be breaking loose in this mug. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so um, as I said before, I'll say it again. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. This is your host, LaRon Pierce, signing out with the Prince of L.A. show. Um, yeah. Go ahead and say goodbyes. Deuces, y'all. Two. We turned oh, up. What? Hey. Hey. Deuces, I'm out. And we'll be ba- I'll be I'm back driving. on there at 6 o'clock. <laughs> I mean, not 6 o'clock. I'm thinking about Generation Utah. Shout out to Scotty Trippin' on Generation Radio Show. They're going to be on every Friday at 6 o'clock, but they're not going to be on the show <laughs> this week. So, But just shout out to them. And shout out to everybody. Shout out to Dolo Pacino, my mi- my mi- my middle school teacher who taught me everything he knows. So almost played the song real quick, but um yeah. So thanks again. This is LaRon Pierce signing out. Peace. Yo, who with it? Gonna make it move with it. My body spirit. It's in the lyrics. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it. Smooth with it. Got the groove with it. Yo, who with it? Gonna make you move with it. My body spirit. It's in the lyrics. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it. Color with production that will take over corruption. Lyrics that will preserve rather than go in destruction. Smooth like silk and glass. We step aside as we show you how it's done. Our music can never divide. All together now, cause we here for the better now. Making the cheddar now, no matter the weather bow. Getting ahead of foul mentalities that allow all the foolishness to go on playing them out aloud. Wearing the ears out, pain to this effective. That's where we come in with a new group of collective. Sounds that will suit the mind state to complete the shine. Wait, we standing right behind. Great don't make the boss be fine. Hey, take it, utilize. Wait, use it as our own escape from common world outside the gate. We make it true to us. Never let the pull of dust turn the glow from the rust. Rising from the earth's crust. So who you really want to trust? Smooth with it. Got the groove with it. Yo, who with it? Gonna make you move with it. Mind, body, spirit. Beats in the lyrics. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it. Just wanna say move with it. Got the groove with it. Yo, who with it? Gonna make you move with it. Mind, body, spirit. Beats in the lyrics. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it. Just wanna make you groove cause we know how to do it. Look within ourselves, the music, we gonna choose it. No one can refuse it. We thought of it over and done. Thought it was only for fun. Keeping it real with this one and another one. Album releases, whatever happens, we'll keep on making these masterpieces. Our prize possessions that we created, straight and evaded. Go ahead and hate it, I feel we already made it. Just a matter of time, I'm representing the rhyme. Could we keep on laying down beats at the drop of a dime? Laying it on the line, the way we go about it. Even with the industry now getting more crowded. Make our own go up, show them all what's up. Show those who didn't take a chance on us, they messed up. We keep it mashing, flavor was done on our fashion, but never flashing. Keeping it humble and dashing. Smooth with it, got the groove with it. Yo, who with it? Good at making move with it. My body spirit, beats in the lyrics. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it. Smooth with it, got the groove with it. Yo, who with it? Good at making move with it. My body spirit, beats in the lyrics. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it. Smooth with it, got the groove with it. Yo, who with it? Good at making move with it. My body spirit, beats in the lyrics. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it. Smooth with it, got the groove with it. Yo, who with it? Good at making move with it. Never heard nothing like this before you hear it.